Smurfy greetings YouTubers, it is I Hell Gear. Welcome back to Smurf's Epic Run. It's time to get through this gate. And as always, remember to like, sub, and bell. We just gotta get the gift at the end. And referee Papa Smurf still just does not want to chill. So everybody's cool. We'll take Snappy. And it's time to run. If there's one thing, I should have switched over to the, uh, I should have switched over to the double point sector. Would have got paid, but it's all right. If there's one thing I have to do, and I mean this, if there's one thing I have to do is I have to catch up on all of these Smurf games, man, because so much is coming out, and I'm already behind as it is. You know. I've been trying to work out a lot of the issues. <clears throat> that I have going and it's not easy it really isn't but once I figure all this stuff out and I'm going to I can get back to playing some more of the games because as you guys know there's a certain party game <clears throat> revolving around our blue friends that's coming out. I already reserved this the Smurfs party game though. And we break through. What's in the trophy? 500 leaves or blue leaves. Loot, loot. All right then. And the Smurf has disappeared. Less than 300 gold. Okay. This will work. Uh, sure. We'll take Nurse Smurf for this one. Okay. That's not so bad. Kind of in trouble now, though, because I'm coming up on 200 coins. There we go, sweet. I thought I wasn't going to make that, but I was just fine. And I'll take that loot home with me. And here's our Smurfy friend back again. 300 coins in one run. They really just want me to use Pop the referee Papa Smurf. Weather Smurf or Smurf Lily? Um, let's do Smurf Lily. Sure. We need to give her more love. All right, then. Let's 
keep it moving. Keep it moving. All right. Let's see, what else do I have to obtain? Okay. That was nice. I could have saved that crap. <laughs> Try that again. Ah, all right. So let's see. Things I have to do Smurf game wise. I got to do the last bit of the racers for Smurfs cart. Then once I've done that, it's into the prisoner of Greenstone. But with the way things are right now, I don't want to do any more videos the low-tech way unless I have to. And I really have to get more of this high-tech game stuff done. Reload on the magnet. And another reload on the magnet. There we go. I'm mad at that one. <laughs> I was actually mad at that. Thank you, Lily. That gets me some loot. And this gets me some more loot. And lots of loot means I can play the Smurfs machine. What's in the chest? Eight big coins. You know what? I will use basketball Smurf. Because we haven't used basketball smoke too much. I like how he just holds the basketball, man. That's that's some of the funniest stuff. You know, he holds the basketball. Oh, I'm supposed to get eight power-ups. This is bad. I should have switched Pussy Willow Pixies. Oh, no, I'm getting the big coins. Jeez. Where are all the big coins? Keep forgetting the tasks, and I shouldn't be doing that. There we go. Haha, -ha, when you can cheat it. Haha. -ha. And the punishment for when you can't. All right, let's try this again. I found out recently because they were like, hey, Hellgear, my peoples were like, watch the trailer for Village Party again. 
right? And I did. And I found out that my boy Pirate Smurf, man, is in Village Party. It's just unfortunate he's not wearing the same outfit in this game as he is in Village Party. Reload on the rainbow. I should have double jumped for that one. I should have double jumped for that one. Basketball Smurf has double jump. Okay. We'll just use the continue here. Glad I didn't use the boost. Very glad I didn't use the boost. Took a couple of tries, but we got through. All right. Bring two Smurfs to the end. You know what? We will use Officer Smurf for this. All enemy immunity will make this a breeze. This should be a breeze. So now, as long as I don't let hubris get the better of me, As long as I don't let hubris get the better of me, this should be an easy challenge or an easy trial clear. I wonder if Officer Smurf, yeah, Police Smurf, Police Smurf, Officer Smurf, same damn thing. Wonder if he's gonna be in the village party. For the longest of time, I could never understand the combination of invincibility and immunity. But I think I finally understand how powerful that combo is. <laughs> to be immune to enemies to get an invincibility potion. That mess is just broken. Too bad Smurf Storm doesn't have the full enemy immunity that Police Smurf does. One of these days, I'm gonna make a Smurf's Epic Run tier list. Grandpa! <laughs> Grandpa finally showing up to the trials. And you know what? We are going to play with Grandpa. Because we can. Good to have Grandpa Smurf here. 
his almost busted ass. He probably won't be in the village party though, and that's okay. Save that for the young Smurfs. Yep, save it for the young Smurfs. That reminds me, I have to do the update for Smurfs Village. Because Smurfs Village did get a get an update. Reload on the... <laughs> I don't need to reload that. Grandpa's Infinite Rainbows. Infinite rainbows. Which means he's almost unkillable. <laughs> Gotta love it when the Smurfs are almost unkillable. Too bad Microids didn't get in touch with the Ubisoft of France, so they could have picked this up. 50 seconds on the ground. I will take Maraca Smurf, sure. Mardi Gras over, but I can still play. with Maraca Smurf. Oh, I have to stay on the ground for 50 seconds. I actually cheated that. All right, halfway there. Reload that. I'm running out of row here. I could have made that 50 seconds. I just kept jumping up. Gotta stay on the ground for that. Ten bumpers. Let's take Centurion Smurf. Sure. Now of all the cool looking Smurfs in this game to play with. This dude right here, it's too bad he's not gonna be in more games. I could have actually saved that jump, I'm upset. Let's try that again. All right, let's try that again. Like, this game has some cool looking Smurfs in it. Like, Centurion Smurf is definitely one of the cooler looking ones. Right? Like, the, the, the Spartan armor is awesome. I'm mad at that one.
Like, I should have been able to get those biggins. Speaking of biggins, I might as well talk about this, right? Because apparently they're making an animated version of Married with Children. Yeah, an animated Married with Children. Like, I don't know how many of you guys watching have seen the 90s sitcom Married with Children. If you haven't, man, that's so that's unfortunate. Because that stuff is gold. But they're actually making an animated version of this. Oh, I. <laughs> oh, well. They're making an animated version of that sitcom. What's in this chest? All right, next trial. Yep, we'll play with the baby. Like, let's just be real. Making animated sequels to these... Animated, animated revisions of all of these sitcoms is like, you have to do it right. Like, don't be like how Seth MacFarlane did. With good times. Like. almost saved that one i'm gonna continue like look the show good times was before my time all right i'm not gonna lie it was before my time but it does show up and air on tv one And expendable HP. That's why I died like that, folks, because I had to die eight times. To those of you who are probably wondering, why was I dying so much? That's why. Don't get me wrong. I respect Seth MacFarlane as a show creator, okay? I do respect this man, but let's be frank, all right? You know what, we'll take Hefty for this. Let's be frank for a moment, folks. And I wanna be crystal clear on this. When I saw the trailer, when I saw the trailer for good, the Good Times animated series on Netflix, I looked at that and I said, what the hell did they do to this show? Right? That's literally what came out of my mind. I was like, what the hell did they do to this show? What did Seth MacFarlane do? Right? 
And I was reading the backstory on this, okay? As it said in the intro, the dad mentions James Edwards. Yeah, that's right. All them traps. Dunzo. Now, let me just hold on to everybody. Right? So here's the thing. John Amos, to those of you who don't know this, Ah, uh, I'm at the end. John Amos was James Ed is James Edwards, as mentioned in this cartoon. All right. This James Edwards is actually not the dad from the sitcom. Happy Smurf? Uh, you know what? Sure. Sure. The dad in this animated version is actually JJ. All right. Is this is JJ's story? He's grown up. He's got the kids of his own. Right? That's what, that's what I'm thinking is happening. But what I'm thinking is actually... Ah, son of a... Mm, I'm mad at that. I'm mad at that. Right, because the month, because in the other it says his grandfather James Edwards, and the James Edwards, of course, is who John Amos played in the in the sitcom. So, beautiful. Part of me is thinking. That this is actually Woo! I should have lost some Smurfs there. Part of me is thinking that it's actually JJ as the dad or it's JJ's son but clearly JJ did not get out of the project all that all that talent painting pictures he did not get out of the project damn shame and the fact that they got a drug dealing baby is terrible hopefully the Mary with children animated series isn't as bad as this good time shit because I I'm not even going to hate watch that that's just a waste of time and that has nothing to do with black struggle thank you guys so much for watching this remember to like sub and bell but for now I take my goose from the oven because I'm done